Hello. I am going to do an upload today of how I do the Big Bank quietly. I'm going to be doing it solo on Deathwish difficulty. The benevolent bank stands at 50 I'm going to do a quick rundown of how I play and what setup I use. My ghost build, uh, the main ones you want, of course, cleaner so you can buy the body bag asset. Chameleon basic, so that you can mark guards and cameras while you're in casing mode. ECM overdrive, to use ECMs as uh, key cards for certain security doors. Of course, you want a faster lockpick, it'll be helpful here. Camera loop can be helpful, but you don't need it aced. I just like it for the extra 10 seconds. Fugitive tree. You want six cents aced, so you can pick up items while you're in casing mode. Also, you can also uh, mark people while you're standing still. And the uh, Winston Wolf aced will really help out with your uh, cleaner costs in stealth, especially when you're doing uh, missions quietly on Deathwish. It'll be cost uh, fifty thousand dollars per civilian, but with uh, this skill aced, it only uh, charges you. Uh, $12,500. Mastermind, the ones you want are Control Freak Aced, so you can get those special insider help assets, as well as Dominator Basic can help you in a bind. So I'm going to be using two ECMs. I've got my uh, Raven Shotgun and Judge Shotgun to get my detection down to about a 7. And Perk Deck, I'm going to use Burglar, mainly for Luck of the Irish, for lockpicks even 20% uh, faster, as well as Dutch Courage, where you can answer pagers 10% faster. Let's get started. As far as pre-planning goes, I may select the elevator trick for my escape. Dead drop, I'm gonna buy body bags for the manager's office. And insider help, I'm gonna buy a key card for the management corridor. You know Alright. First things first, we wanna find the loose key card. Can be in any of these teller areas. You know the drill. Watch for the guards and cameras. Keep civilians in check. Look around for key cards. And the bank manager. Anything that might help. Keep an eye out for cameras, because we're gonna have to be down here. Got one camera here. That's the server room. Get Got the server get room. Looks like the vault is going to be upstairs. Could be also anywhere on these tables or these bars, which I don't see it. Got a camera. Guard, stay quiet. Watch out, guard. You have the keys here, which that'll be useful. Card is not here either. So then we can check these little end tables. Not here. Look out, camera. And not here. So that means it should be somewhere on one of these desks. Go. So we'll go ahead and pick that up. But it could be in any of, any of these desks as well. God, stay alert. Take a look around for cameras, which I do see one camera there. So I've got a camera downstairs and I have a camera upstairs offices. Got manager heading out. Got two managers. Let's have a barney. Get 
landing on the ground. Good. Make the cops think twice about coming Holy. in here. Follow me. You sure you want to do that? Sorry, Control. My partner bet me ten bucks I wouldn't call you, so all I right. won. Got three managers all in one spot. Hit the ground. Down. Come with me. Nymphs, eh? Come with me. On me. Stay down, down. Follow me. Follow me. Now I get these managers out of sight here. On me. Close your eyes and go to your Follow safe me. place. Stay put. Down on the ground. Now, come with me. Follow me. On me. Follow me. Now we're gonna check the roof. Then we look at where the drill will be. A good spawn will be down here. Because you could freeze the guards at the bottom of the staircase. Another great spawn will be here. Another useful spawn, but not quite as helpful, would be the one right here. But when it's down there, it's useless. So we're not going to do anything up here on the roof. And we're going to have to kill the... Uh, the two guards that walk around. Watch out, CCTV. You want to try to avoid breaking cameras right now? It's going to help you later. But now we just play the waiting game. Basically. I'm just waiting for the next manager and one more guard to show up. Now that we have two cards dead and I'm waiting for the last manager, I'm going to set up a drill here on this safe. What this does is that it attracts the guards on the other side of this wall and it freezes them inside the stairwell to where I can just avoid them entirely. And I'm going to keep waiting for the next manager. Now that I have the last manager, I'm going to wait for their, these guards to start freezing on the other side of this wall. As you can see, I have all four guards frozen on the other side of the wall. Got one, two, three, and then four. That was right here. Now we can move on to the next part. And that's going to be getting these civilians down. The civilians are taken care of. Just take a look for cameras. Check how many body bags.
remove this corpse just because I don't want anybody freaking out within sight of the people downstairs. CM overdrive comes in handy. Alright, normally, this is where having a second player comes in handy, because you can have one player continue to use the computer, because if you listen real closely, You can hear a beep in the sound background. That computer will have a red error screen, and I'll try and upload a picture of it. That you want to look for. And now, unfortunately, because I'm by myself, I have to just use every single computer that I come across. Luckily, using each computer doesn't set off the alarm if you use the wrong one. Time lock. We want to keep an eye on these elevators. It's gonna be a. You gotta be quick on your feet. Expect heat from there. Let me focus on the downstairs elevator. activation of your time lock. I'm just calling to confirm everything is fine. Yeah, everything's fine. Just a scheduling conflict. Had a major account holder turn up out of the blue. Got it. No problem. Just keep us informed. Roger that. You guys are doing a great job. Bye. I suck or fell for it. Just wanted to say hello, Control. So, uh, are you married? If you're keeping count, we're at three pagers that we've had to burn right now. But now that we've gotten that guard taken care of and the other civilian, all we have to focus on now is the camera room in the back area of the vault. That's the time lock done. Try and keep the sneak going. Now, the vault has a three-step clearance control. The first I've already taken care of. Just head there and use the fingerprint scanner. Watch out, guard! Guard! Well, I guess I miscounted. There's Watch five guards, Watch out, guard! But... Instead of going for the camera room in this case, because I'm by myself, I think it's gonna be easier if I kill this guy that's walking around. Don't the guard. guard on patrol! Guard! Because I can avoid the cameras easily guard, enough. Guard, stay alert! Guard, stay back! Hands up! Okay, don't 
Sorry, but... Sorry, I, I've been reading the Walking Dead comic. It scares the shit out of me. I, I'm a bit shook up. Watch out, CCTV. Alright. So, now... I'm gonna go ahead and open up the ball. Things like thumbs. I operate a don't ask, don't tell policy. Now, get to the security consoles. That's the first console. Now the second. Look out, camera. Great. Now, the last step. Find the manager's code. It should be on his computer. Connected. Let's see what we have. Got the code. Get back to the vault. And... Open. It worked. Great job, everyone. If you're looking for keys, they can be in a few places. It could be up here if the vault is up here. Sometimes there's a box here. Or it could be inside one of these office areas. So you just want to kind of look around for that little white key box. It's not always up in the front area. It could be along these walls. A little bit everywhere. But you want to use the keys if you're going to use the drill to glitch the guards or use a silent saw. You don't want to do anything that could potentially unfreeze them because right now they're out of the way and we don't even have to deal with them, which is ideal. All we need to do is just start moving bags over to the uh, elevators. Now that you have all the bags down in the elevator, it's time to just start securing them all. Quite as the governor's son or a sardine. This is a story day, gang. You finally cracked the banana. I can't believe I actually forgot a bag. But there you go. Big bank, death wish difficulty, stealth. If you like this video, feel free to uh, stay a little bit longer. I may do a, a quick review of the other drill locations up on the roof. And thank you for watching. Alright, as you can see, there is a guard frozen on the left side of my screen. And I'm going to show you up on the roof. The drill is on the left side of the building, closest to the ladder, as you can see. And if we head downstairs, there should be a guard that'll also be frozen inside the break room. If you have a second player to help you spot this guy before he leaves the break room and you can place the drill when he's in there, that's ideal. Example number two. So when the drill is up on top, let that freeze. Sorry, let it break. And sure enough, there's that guard frozen. 